Kenya Quinn's cutting and sewing her way to the top. Selected from her class for a month-long internship at the Glasson's head office later this year. And while the wind's unexpected, she's stoked with the opportunity, as she thinks ahead to her career. In the future I do want to have my own label, so anything, I, and I love to learn, so anything that I can gain more knowledge is an amazing opportunity. Quinn used her graduate collection to vie for the internship. It's a work in progress and she says adapting the pieces for the challenge was simple allowing her to focus on a theme of mental illness within the creative industry. I did things like oversized silhouettes, um, all my edges were raw um, and frayed and coming apart and um, I had um, things that tied and constricted the body but also overwhelmed it. The minimalistic collection samples a muted palette, influenced by Quinn's local surroundings. She says being Dunedin-based dictates her style with an emphasis on comfort. I do always design layers, so maybe that's a bit of Dunedin influence there. Um, always prepared for whatever weather. As she approaches the end of her degree and in coveted industry experience, Quinn's fine-tuning her work for public scrutiny. By now we've figured out who we are and what we want to show the world. Our final collection is kind of showing what we can do and advertising ourselves. After her November internship, Quinn plans to study the business side of fashion, hoping to be the next big name associated with the Dunedin aesthetic. Ruby McAndrew, 39, Dunedin News.